It'll have a bed. Yeah, but that can't be the name of the actual bed, is it? It's that way. No, that's a shower. Is that a dodo, is it? Do I need the dodo? Mauritius is LFC's global partner. Visits to Mauritius and to the iconic Anfield are unforgettable experiences, delivering memories that last forever. But how good are these players and fans' powers of recall? Three Liverpool FC players. Six fans. <laughs> three teams. Even I've learned something today. Three challenges to make memories last forever. First time I come here. Just never forget that feeling. My best memory was my wedding day. We got a tour of the stadium. My earliest memory was coming to Anfield for the first time. It wasn't the biggest game ever, but it was big to me. I love it because I'm spending time with my dad and that. Just good, because I don't get to see my sister and they're quite annoying, so that's good. <laughs> In our first challenge, our contestants must answer questions from the press. But what they don't know is that they'll have a little bit of help from the Liverpool players. <laughs> what are you good? What's going on, family? Nice to meet you. Hi. Nice to meet you, okay? Yes, please. The Mauritius flag features red, blue, yellow, and green. Can you name club teams that wear each colour? Red, Liverpool. Red and blue. Crystal Palace. Green for Celtic. Norwich. We're both in it, just together. So I'll give that one as the both of them. Borussia Dortmund for yellow. Go with you next. Sugarcane is one of Mauritius' biggest exports and was imported into Liverpool until 1981. In that year, who did Liverpool beat to win the European Cup for the third time? I wasn't even born, then. That's before my time, isn't it? Real Madrid. Oh, lovely. That's why you're here. Over here. Yes, please. Sharing a name with Liverpool's Uruguayan striker, this scientist visited Mauritius in 1836. Charles? Darwin. <laughs> Last one. The national animal of Mauritius is the dodo, but what bird features on the Liverpool club crest? The lava bird. Oh, perfect. <laughs> the lava bird. Yeah, but that can't be the name of the actual bird, is it? Even I've learned something today. <laughs> OK, then. No, it's light, it's light, it's light, it's only right here. Now for a mad scramble around the changing rooms to find the next clue. You know that the national animal of Mauritius is a dodo. Can you find the winged one there? Hidden in the changing rooms. Winged? Found it. Yes. My son, is that a dodo, is it? You have found it. Time for you. Your last challenge. Which is just around the corner. No, that's a shower. Do I need the dodo? The teams head out pitch side for our final challenge. The Mauritian flag. It's four it's colours. Put what in order. Collect the corner flag. And display them in the correct order. Be quick. You don't have long. You have them too. I have them too. Oops. What order are we going though? My God, I'm stiff after last night. <laughs> I'm going to go here. Was it yellow green? And what are we going? Yellow green. Yellow green, yeah, yeah, go, go. Yeah, it's got to be. Is that good? Correct. Oh! Hey! Yes, the boys. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. <laughs> Oh, you mean you're good? Okay. Yes, little man, you're good. <laughs> you have all completed the challenges in under 15 minutes, so a big congratulations. You have all won hospitality to our next game and signed shirts. So there we go, you're all winning! Well well you was the slowest, bro. So I won 10 press ups. <laughs> Memories last forever with Mauritius and Liverpool Football Club.